Ghostface Killer recently cleared up a rumor about whether or not he was beefing with Raekwon. I'm Asia Sky for Hip Hop DX and check this out. Ghostface Killer has cleared up the rumors stirred by the Hulu series Wu Tang and American Saga that he and Raekwon had beef before joining the Wu Tang clan. On the latest episode of the Outside with Gorilla Nim series, Ghostface set the record straight and revealed that he never had any issues with his Wu Tang brother before their rap fame. Fans were led to believe that there was friction between the duo after the aforementioned Hulu series portrayed them as violent enemies during their youth in Staten Island, New York. Ghost and Ray's on screen beef was so intense that they even wanted to kill each other, but they managed to bury the hatchet and find common ground, which led them to joining Wu Tang. According to Ghost, however, that part of the show's storyline is far from truth. Me and Ray never had beef. Okay. That's what I told you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, me and Ray never had no, no problems. It was, you know, the, the way them characters got switched around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Y'all probably laugh about this shit, right? Like, now you look at that, you're like... I mean, I don't, I don't laugh about that shit yeah. because, um, this shit is, you know... It's in the past. That shit ain't my, <laughs> yeah. shit ain't my story, you know? Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, but, um, 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 you know, Ray, my bro. That's my bro. I love him. We just had, we had chemistry. Yeah, facts. We had chemistry. Like, he taught me a lot of shit. He taught me a lot of shit, a lot of slang. Because up, up where they from, they was like slang fucking... Facts. They had too Lounge. much slang. RZA previously spoke about the historical accuracy of Wu-Tang, the American Saga, in 2019, telling Newsweek the show was historical fiction and that you can't take every moment and expound on it. However, in 2012, RZA told the Los Angeles Times that Ghostface and Raekwon started off as enemies in the neighborhood, but became best friends afterward. Ray backed up that claim in a 2013 interview with Vlad TV, saying there was animosity between them because of beef between rival neighborhoods. You go to the hood and niggas, you know, 10 blocks away, niggas don't know you, niggas don't fuck with you, niggas will gun you if they feel like you in the way, you know what I mean? So we always stayed on our side. So when RZA formed this alliance, you know, the names that was brought to the table, it was definitely spoken on like, yo, psh, I don't really fuck with ghosts. Like, you know what I mean? Like, he's, you know, he's a crook. Mm -hmm. You never know, but when RZA, when RZA was the middle guy, it was almost like he did a Gotti move. Like, he brought all the families to the table, you know what I mean, and made niggas make, make men's due to the fact of how we gonna move forward and get this money. So what do you think about Ghostface clearing up the rumors of a beef with Raekwon? And do you think the Wu-Tang Clan series should try to be more factual? Or is it okay that they're dramatizing these things to make the show better? Let us know what you think in the comment section below. Also make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell and stay locked in to Hip Hop DX.